Hi all, welcome to the session. We have learned the operators of angular momentum, the simultaneous eigenstates and eigenvalues of L square L set, and also we have learned the peculiarity of total angular momentum, and we learned the eigenstate and eigenvalues of total angular momentum, and we discussed how these half integer values are included in the eigenvalues of total angular momentum which we haven't considered the same in the orbital angular momentum. So in this session we will learn how to represent angular momentum operators in a matrix form or the angular momentum matrices. E components in a so we have learned different components like we have learned jx, jy, jz j square then j plus j minus so many components of angular momentum are there so we will learn how to represent these components in the form of matrices let us consider the ket jm be the simultaneous eigenvector of j square and j z j square and j z simultaneous eigenvector because our and the community Baki would come on the parasperum commute in so that we can take a simultaneous eigenvector for J square and J Z. Let this JM get JM be the simultaneous eigenvector of J square and J Z. And as you know, these eigenvectors can be chosen to be normalized to unity. So that you can write Ra JM get JM must be equal to 1. So it is integral psi star psi equal to 1, normalization condition. So in this way you can write if it is normalized to unity you can write in this form and another thing is that the eigenvectors of Hermitian operators correspond to different eigenvalues are orthogonal Hermitian operators in the uh, eigenvectors in the eigenvectors orthogonal uh, means orthogonal eigenvalues so that by clubbing these two we can write the orthonormal condition of this kit Ah, eigenvector in the orthonormal condition okay, it is nothing but is the orthonormal condition is equal to delta j j dash delta m m dash right. it is equal to 1 when j becomes equal to j dash and m becomes equal to m dash and equal to 0 when j not equal to j dash and m not equal to j dash so this is the orthonormal condition of the eigenvector ket j so by using this orthonormal set of like the orthonormal set of this k jm states can be used as a basis to represent angular momentum in the form of matrix e orthonormal set to be used to kondana nammal endu construct cheyan povunathu angular momentum matrix construct cheyan povunathu for example in this representation a function f generalized nammal parayana in this representation e matrix representation a function f of the angular momentum components. I F1 no the angular momentum components in the function I call it. It can be represented by a matrix with elements J dash M dash F J. So this is the idea. E orthonormal set of Get JM states to be able to the angular momentum matrix. So suppose if F is a function of uh, the angular momentum components it can be represented by a matrix. I F a matrix side it can be represented by a matrix with elements. Or element is given by this one bra j dash m dash f ket j. In this way you can I can get notation you can represent the matrix elements of that particular angular momentum component. For example if you want to say what is the angular momentum representation of J vector you can say Instead of f, you have to write j. If you want to know what is the angular momentum matrix representation of j square, instead of f, you have to write j square. So this is the general form, and the rows of the matrix will be given by j dash n dash. and the column of the matrix is given by j n dash. Our matrix in the row number one is j dash n dash. Our matrix in the column number one is j m dash. So this is a 
introduction to explain how to represent angular momentum with angular momentum components in the matrix. So, we will see the same thing. We will see the same condition. The orthonormal condition is the same matrix element. We will see the formula in this formula. In this formula, you have to write what? The matrix element in the corresponding angular momentum matrix. So, also it obeys the orthonormal condition. That is the matrix of J square and J is the matrix. Okay. So, first step, we have the matrix of J square and J is the matrix. Can you say what is the form of these matrices? J square and J is the matrix form. It should be diagonal matrix. Because you can select a particular eigenvector. The simultaneous eigenvector for both J square and J is the matrix. So, that you can expect a diagonal matrix for J. J square and J Z. But you can't expect a diagonal matrix for Jx, Jy and Jz. Why? Because Jz doesn't commute with Jy or Jz. But J square and Jz commute to change the other one. You are not a matrix in the diagonal matrix. You are not a matrix in the diagonal matrix. Diagonal matrix. So, we have to write the introduction part. If you want to write a matrix, you need matrix element. That matrix element is the general form. This is the J dash M dash. If we have a general function, we will write it. So, here you have to find out what is the matrix of J square. This is of the form J square. So, you have to say the eigen get notation of this one. You have to find out what is the answer of this representation. This representation is the answer of this representation. We will write it. We will write it. We will write it. We will write it. And you know the matrix position, right? Element position is the area. This is the matrix. This is 1, 1, 1, 2, 1, 3. Then 2, 1, 2, 2, 2, 3. Ah, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, let get Jm be the eigenvector of J square and J Z so that you can write J square get Jm must be equal to what? J into J plus 1 H cut square. Now can you ask about this? This is the eigenvalue. J into J plus 1 H cut square get Jm. And J Z get Jm is nothing but M into H bar get Jm. So this is the eigenvalue equation of J square in terms of the eigenvector. Get J. Angana anangi. Multiply these two equations. Pre multiply these two equations with bra j dash and dash. J dash and dash would be pre multiply. From first equation pre multiply even with j dash m dash j square j m must be equal to j into j plus 1 h square square. What is it? We will do the bra j dash m dash and we will pre-multiply it. So that it is of the form j dash m dash j m. We will learn the orthogonal condition to obey the same condition. So that the answer is no j j dash no m m dash. So just substitute this one. So this one is equal to pre multiply with bra j dash m dash. The answer is delta j j dash delta m m dash. So the answer. So we can add the third negative. J dash m dash j square j m. This is j into j plus 1 h cut square. So you you have to use this formula to find out the matrix element. J into j plus 1 h cut square delta j j dash delta m m dash. So what is the answer for? Next, J dash, M dash, J is the J. This must be equal to M H bar delta J, J dash, delta M, M dash. So this is a matrix element for the angular momentum matrix J. And the presence of this delta J, J dash or delta and delta M, M dash indicates that the matrices are diagonal as we expected. We have we have under the assumption that the matrices of J square and J Z must be diagonal. So in the matrix element representation, this chronicle delta comes at 
matrix element representation, it clearly indicates that the matrices J square and J Z are diagonal matrices. Okay. So first we will write what is the form of these matrices for J square and J Z and we are taking some J values. We are taking J values 0, half, 1 or you can take 3 by 2, 2 etc. So first we are taking the three values, what is the matrix representation of J square and J Z when J takes value 0, half, 1. In the similar manner you can write the matrix representation for other J values also. Engane ana a matrix representation like a form. Valathe sradhi chiri kya, elukko ana. Ito ori kya dhengal edithi padi cha you can use the same idea to write the other matrix also. Eadhi matrix ori chari you can write. First, we need to know what is the form of the matrix element. That is easy to know what is the form of the matrix element. That is easy to know what is the form of the matrix element. That is easy to know what is the form of the matrix element. Now, let's go directly to the matrix form. In one table, we are just writing all the matrices for J square. First, we are going to write the matrix of J square. So that you know, the icon, sorry, the matrix element must take this form. This J into J plus 1 H cut square delta J J dash delta M dash M dash and we are they are constructing a table which includes all the uh, matrix representation. As you all know here we are taking J values, 3 J values when J equal to 0, J equal to half and J equal to 1. So for J equal to 0 matrix the matrix will come here, J equal to half the representation will come here and J equal to 1 the matrix will come here. So as you will know, when j equal to 0, what are the possible values of m? m takes 0. When j equal to half, what are the possible values of m? It is minus half plus half. Right. And for j equal to 1, you should take uh, the m values 1, 0, minus 1. So this is a general representation. And as I told earlier, j dash m dash will give you the row form and j m will give you the column of the matrix. Other column that is no. J dash M dash row there. So, we will look at what is the matrix representation. First, we will look what is the matrix form when J equal to 0. So, here you can say J equal to 0, M equal to 0. J dash equal to 0, M dash equal to 0. So, just look at this matrix element form. The form is J into J plus 1 H cut square. We will look at the back of the So, if you look at the back of the you have to see the combination where j becomes equal to j dash. j in j dash, m um m dash on the combination mathra may even do it to element where it is. j o j dash o unequal angle theorem 0. m o m dash o unequal angle theorem 0. Random same angle mathra may have a number element. But she would have first delay what is the j value? j value itself is 0. So you can't get any element in j equal to 0 form. So the matrix form, it's an null matrix form, j equal to 0. So j equal to 0 is the matrix form, it is a null matrix. Next we can look what is the form of the matrix when j equal to half. That is the matrix form, j equal to half is a matrix form. Then j equal to half is a matrix form, how many elements? m will take half minus half, so that you will see half minus half. So that it will be a 2 by 2 matrix. 2 by 2 matrix side. So first element is j equal to half. Okay. So you have j values here. We have to substitute here. We have to position here. First j, j dash is equal to half. So what is j? Half. j dash itself half. So the delta j, j dash is 1. Okay. You will get the answer. And the next what is the answer? m, m dash. m, m, m dash is equal to half. So this is the m dash value and this is the m value. So if you write the combination, yeah, m, m dash equal to half, m equal to half. So that you will get a value at the first position. First row, first column, you can get the element element because m dash, m, m and the other one, same idea. Ethra value, so that you have to substitute. Ethra value, the value is half. So half into half plus one h cut square so it is equal to 1 delta j j dash equal to 1 delta m m dash equal to 1 so it is half plus 1 it is 3 by 2 into 1 by 2 3 by 4 h cut square so the position of the first the value of the first element is 3 by 4 h cut square 3 by 4 h cut square 
and next half minus half so the n dash value is half m value is minus half so what's the answer so that delta m m dash equal to zero so the second element is zero and what about the second row first column minus half plus half again the answer is zero minus half minus half yeah you will get a element there because delta m m dash one now what is the what is the uh, value of that element it is nothing but this one that one that m m m dash m equal number you get the matrix element and the value of the matrix element is again j into j plus one h square square other than that j into j plus one h square square and he combination j value no more it is not j value is half so again it is three by four h square So this is the matrix form of the angular momentum when j equal to half. This is the same as j equal to zero let's write and j equal to half let's write. So after coming, so this is a simple way to represent this matrix. So after writing this table, you know, in the end, more matrix matrix is cited there. So for j equal to zero, it's a null matrix, and for j equal to half, the matrix is either you can take three h cut square by four outside, so that you can say three h cut square by four one zero zero. Pretty. So this is the matrix representation of the angular momentum component J square when J equal to half. Clear. Next, this one. So here you can easily say what is the answer because the m dash value is half, but over here m ba m value is under the half and the so that you will get zero zero and again you will get zero zero. So that you you get again a null matrix. You get a null matrix. ഇവിടെ എന്തായിരിക്കും സീറോ വരും കാരണം എന്താ ഹാഫും ജയും ജെ ഡാഷും സീറോ ആണ് ജെ ഡാഷും ജെയും സീറോ ആണ് സോ സീറോ ഇൻ ദ നെക്സ്റ്റ് വാട്ട് ഇസ് ദ നെക്സ്റ്റ് വാല്യൂ ഇഫ് യു ടേക്ക് ജെ ഈക്വൽ ടു വൺ അപ്പോൾ നമ്മൾ ഏത് എടുത്താൽ മതി സോ വൺ സീറോ ജെ ഈക്വൽ സോറി ജെ ഡാഷ് ഈക്വൽ ടു വൺ ജെ ഈക്വൽ ടു സീറോ സോ ഡിഫറെൻ്റ് ആണ് സോ യു ഗെറ്റ് സീറോ ജെ ഡാഷ് ഈക്വൽ ടു വൺ ജെ ഈക്വൽ ടു ഹാഫ് അഗെയിൻ ഇറ്റ് ഈസ് സീറോ ജെ ഡാഷ് ഈക്വൽ ടു വൺ ജെ ഈക്വൽ ടു വൺ ഇൻ ദിസ് പൊസിഷൻ യു കൻ expect a matrix ivada ningalku a matrix right so first value j dash sorry m dash 1 m1 so that you will get an element there ningalku avadu element kittum kadam m dash m same aayidund delta m m dash endu varum oru uttaram adinu so ad ethra irun nokka indu idha mathi j into j plus 1 h plus square so what is j j is 1 so 1 into 1 plus 1 it is 2 so the answer is 2 എത്ര ആയിരിക്കും മൂന്ന് എലിമെന്റ് അവിടെ ഉള്ളത് കൊണ്ട് ത്രീ ബൈ ത്രീ മെട്രിക്സ് ആയിരിക്കും നമുക്ക് പെട്ടെന്ന് എം ഡാഷ് വാല്യൂ വെച്ച് നല്ല നമ്മൾ ഈ എലിമെന്റ് എഴുതുന്നത് എപ്പോഴും പെട്ടെന്ന് സംശയം വരുന്നത് എം ഡാഷ് വാല്യൂ സീറോ ആയതുകൊണ്ട് ഇവിടെ സീറോ എഴുതേണ്ട ടെൻഡൻസി വരും നമ്മൾ എഴുതുന്ന മെട്രിക്സ് എലിമെന്റിൽ ആര് മാത്രമേ ഉള്ളൂ ജെ ഇൻ ജെ പ്ലസ് വൺ എച്ച് കെ സ്ക്വയറേ ഉള്ളൂ അത് എം ഡാഷ് സീറോ ആയാലും എം ഡാഷ് വൺ ആയാലും എം വൺ ആയാലും ജെ വാല്യൂ ഇസ് വൺ ജെ വാല്യൂ എന്താണ് വൺ ആണ് നമ്മൾ നോക്കേണ്ട പൊസിഷൻ കിട്ടുമോ കിട്ടും സീറോ സീറോ ആയതുകൊണ്ട് ആ പൊസിഷൻ നിങ്ങൾക്ക് കിട്ടും സോ ദാറ്റ് ഹിയർ ദ വാല്യൂ ഇസ് ടു എച്ച് കെ സ്ക്വയർ സീറോ മൈനസ് വൺ എഗെയിൻ സീറോ മൈനസ് വൺ വൺ സീറോ മൈനസ് വൺ സീറോ മൈനസ് വൺ വൺ മൈനസ് വൺ മൈനസ് വൺ എഗെയിൻ ദ യു വിൽ ഗെറ്റ് എൻ എലിമെന്റ് ഹിയർ so this is the matrix of j square when j equal to 1 this is the matrix of j square when j equal to 1 alle pole they know okay kitta matrix njan parnu j square inde matrix it should be diagonal matrix diagonal matrix aayirikkanam so this one is diagonal and also this one is diagonal if you want to say what is the matrix form of j square when j equal to 3 by 2 ningalku ariyam you have to write J equal to 3 by 2 and write the m values here also write j dash equal to 3 by 2 and write the m dash value take the combination so if you know this concept 
you you will you will be able to write any matrix form of angular momentum ഏത് കമ്പോണൻറ്റും നിങ്ങൾക്ക് എന്ത് ചെയ്യാൻ പറ്റും വളരെ എളുപ്പത്തിൽ എഴുതാൻ പറ്റും ഈ ഒരു ഒറ്റ ടേബിൾ പക്ഷെ ഇത് മാത്രം എഴുതി വെക്കരുത് എസ് ഐ ചോദിച്ചാൽ ആഫ്റ്റർ കൺസൾട്ടിംഗ് ദിസ് ടേബിൾ യു ഹാവ് ടു റൈറ്റ് സെപ്പറേറ്റ്ലി വാട്ട് ഇസ് എ മെറ്റ് ഫോം ഓഫ് വാട്ട് ജെ സ്ക്വയർ വൺ ജെ ഇക്വൽ ടു സീറോ വൺ ജെ ഇക്വൽ ടു ഹാഫ് വൺ ജെ ഇക്വൽ ടു ഓക്കെ ഹോപ്പ് യു അണ്ടർസ്റ്റാൻഡ് ഹൗ ടു റെപ്രസെൻറ്റ് ദി ആംഗ്ല മൊമെൻറ്റ് മെറ്റ്രിക്സ് സോസ് ജെ സ്ക്വയർ നൗ വിൽ ലേൺ how to write the matrix representation of j is that in the similar manner so you please try how to write the matrix representation of j is that in this fashion j is that in the same way you will write it in the same way what is the j dash m dash j is that j m m so the answer is m h bar so you will write it in the same way you will write it in the same way you will write it in the same way but the value of the matrix element is different നേരത്തെ ജെ ഇൻ ജെ പ്ലസ് വൺ എച്ച് കട്ട് സ്ക്വയർ ആയിരുന്നു ഇവിടെ എം എച്ച് ബാർ എം വാല്യൂവിന് അനുസരിച്ച് അവിടെ എന്ത് വരണം മെട്രിക്സ് വാല്യൂട്ട് വാട്ട് ഇസ് ദ ഫോം ഓഫ് ദിസ് മെട്രിക്സ് സോ യു വിൽ ഗെറ്റ് ദ ടേബിൾ ഇൻ ദിസ് ഫോം സോ മെട്രിക്സ് ഓഫ് ജെ സെറ്റ് മസ്റ്റ് ടേക്ക് ദിസ് ഫോം എം എച്ച് ബാർ ഡോ ജെ ജെ ഡാഷ് ഡോ എം എം ഡാഷ് സോ യു ക്യാൻ നൗ നോ ഹൗ ടു റൈറ്റ് ദിസ് മെട്രിക്സ് എലിമെൻറ്റ് സോ ഹിയർ ഇറ്റ് ഇസ് നോട്ട് മെട്രിക്സ് ആൻഡ് ഫോർ ഹാഫ് ഹാഫ് So you can expect a matrix here. So first element, m dash equal to half, m equal to half. So you can expect the first element. And the value of the first element is nothing but m h bar. So here the value of m is half. So it is half h bar. So 0, 0. Here the value of m is minus half. So that the value is minus h by 2. Not h by 2. Here the value is minus h bar by 2. That null matrix. So here. You can expect the value when j dash equal to 1, j equal to 1. So the first element, m dash equal to 1 and m equal to 1. So the first element is 1 h bar. So h bar. So again, null matrix is so 0, 0. Or you can expect an uh, element, but the element value is m h bar. Since m equal to 0, the answer is 0. And minus 1, minus 1. Since the m value is minus 1, you can expect the element as minus h bar there. So this is the matrix representation of J is set when J takes value 0, half, 1. In this way, you can write other J values also. So it's an infinite dimension matrix. So this is a way to write the angular momentum components J square and J is set in matrix. Form. Hope you understand how to write J square and J is set matrix for different J values. Next week, we'll, we'll learn how to write the matrix form of jx jy then j plus and j minus okay